she's not happy in the relationship yeah. anymore. So like, just I guess just. I'm not spoiling it. I'm not spoiling it. Okay. Really? Okay. But like, I think. Just follow your. I think what you find in the movie is that it's not just all happy. Love isn't yeah. always the answer to everything. Sometimes to grow, you need to grow apart. Mm. So you won't find all, you know, the pretty answers in here, but you'll definitely find answers. See, that's what I think movies nowadays have to have. Like they have to have a lot of truth. It's in real. It, in it's real. Yeah, it's and real. that that makes sense because like love is never always just like being about happy, happy all the time. It's about the being time. there during the hard times, right? Yeah. yeah. And yes, amazing. You, you guys, you know what? You're killing this interview. <laughs> you guys are killing this interview. Okay, okay. <clears throat> I know you guys are busy in London. And I heard that there was even times that like the weather was really crazy, and you guys had to wear like clothes that were like kind of you know cold and stuff. I know London was hard, but outside of that, when you were in London, did you find time to do anything else? Like, did when you guys were together, did you enjoy London at all? What did you guys do while you were there? Pretty tight. Yeah, tight schedule. schedule. Yeah. Sometimes I wouldn't have taping, I wouldn't have like scenes okay. for the whole day. So James would shoot the whole day. Sometimes James would shoot the whole day. Ah, wouldn't have scenes for the whole day, and I would. Mm. Um, we didn't really have time to go around, but like, but I'm saying that in because we were going around to shoot things. Yeah. How did it feel like to be like in a different country and just being together and shooting a movie? And I know you've done it before. The, the first, the first time I had that feeling, we were. I think it was about four out the wall. Yeah, okay. we were in San Francisco, up the bridge. <laughs> yeah, yeah and I, I remember that. I was driving a, a convertible, and the Dean's like standing up, and there was a truck in front with cameras, and we're shooting a TV show, and I was like, what? Is this really happening? Like, yeah. We're shooting a TV show in San Francisco. In, That's in amazing. California, it's out in San Francisco. Yeah. It was, yeah, it's an, it's an amazing feeling. It's like, it's how did I get here? Hmm. It, it's crazy to think, because I mean, so much has happened in such a short I mean, it feels like a short amount of time, yeah. but so much has really happened, and just yeah. to see you guys grow and look the way you do, and you guys look so happy and beautiful, and <laughs> I'm just happy for you guys, and I'm excited for this movie. Next question, let's go. <laughs> 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 Why should people watch this movie? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Duh, okay, uh, next question. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, what event in your life would make a good movie or TV series? I don't know if you guys want to answer that. Like, is there anything in your life that you would like to like play off of someday? Like, if you did something that happened from your life? Um, I guess me, my like when I was a teenager and then like growing up, um, and starting being an adult, like a coming of age kind of movie. Because yes. I'm like one of those girls who like never really knew what, who I really was yeah. before. Like, I remember. Was a <laughs> yeah, okay, we go. Like, like that. Look yeah. at the unit. It's like that is true. It's That's very relatable, one. especially to all the young girls. That and would like be all cool. The, all the, um, all the um, older, older girls now, but um, they can relate to that because it, they also had that experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that. Coming I of like age. That. Coming of age. Ooh, that's pretty sick. You want me to go a different question? No, I was, I was thinking like, like I was thinking like <coughs> maybe. A film about what goes on behind the scenes in, in showbiz. No one really does that. Okay, then it does. It's, <laughs> it's a topic people don't want to talk about. Yeah, that's true. They don't want to. People don't know what really goes behind the cameras. Behind the cameras, because it's really hard. The whole show business. You know, and uh, like. Not just because like we're here and there's cameras and stuff or whatever, but like I think you guys do a really good job like keeping it together. I mean, with all the pressure that you guys have to make movies, and you also do music, you also do so many different things. You have families to take care of, and you guys do so much. And I just know that that's just you know. I'm just saying a lot of nice things. <laughs> I, I'm happy for them. Oh, let's go to the next question. <laughs> I'm getting sentimental. <laughs> let's go. <clears throat> you guys have done a lot. Movies, music, family, gone around the world, traveled, done so many things. What else is on your bucket list? What are things you want to do? I, I mean, you guys have jumped out of planes, like, done so many things in your life. What else do you want to do? Um, or is it time to just, you know, leave it all behind and <laughs> go for love? Who knows? Okay. Um, what do you do next? Me, I, there's so much more places I want to go, some travel. Okay. And there's so much more I want to do with music. You know, you know this. 
I have an idea. Yeah. <laughs> Just want to take, it, take I, it to new heights. Yeah. yeah. I want to start directing. I, I you make, know that already. I make music, so if that. you want to... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Video, you want to collab? Yeah. Yeah, right, collab, we could collab. Anyway. I can direct. Yes, you need... Okay, what movie would you like to direct? Like, what would be the first kind of genre you would get into? Ooh, probably something that's like horror. Or like that suspense. would be epic. Because lo- I'm, I'm a huge fan of horror movies. I, I know that. No, I get scared. <laughs> no, I get scared, but yeah. I'm a huge fan. Yes, those are always... <laughs> that's fun times. I, yeah. Which, okay... If you were a director, though, would you get him in your movie? I'll, <laughs> I'll get you. No, <laughs> but, like, get him. Would you want to get me? Would, would, you, would you? Would you? Would you? Would you like? Okay, like imagine you're the director, and then you're like, oh, James. Okay, I thought, yeah, you know you're doing yeah. the directing thing. But I did but that. Him. But I did that. But like, music video. like movie though. I'm talking movie. You know what I mean? I'd love to. Like, what if you directed it and you were the girl? Like that'd be pretty. Crazy. That's gonna be so hard. Though. We're getting, we're getting pretty. Okay. So next question. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. <coughs> it's kind of like the other question, but it's easier now. Okay. What is the best advice that you've been given, like ever, like in terms of anything, mm-hmm. ever? Best advice given. Yeah. What? That's okay. interesting. Yeah. Okay, let's go. It's okay to be sad. It's okay to be not. That's actually really good advice. That's, that's, that's the best advice because I'm, I'm the kind of person who doesn't like showing weakness, yeah. who likes to think that I have everything together. Mm-hmm. And when I feel sad or when I feel like, um, like I'm I'm crumbling down, it makes me think that I'm like I'm stoops. Yeah, but no. It makes me feel like that. That's why. Like you're hella awesome. That's and, why. You know, <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> well, okay, okay, I love that. That's great. That's great. What you got? What's your What's your advice? Um, I've got a lot of advice, but my favorite one. I'm not sure if it's the best. Okay. To me, it seemed like the best. Um, my dad's friend said, "Is there anything you can do about it?" I know this. No, then don't worry about it. That's true. And that's literally how I live my life. And so. Anything that you really can't... It's out of your control. Out of control. Yeah, don't worry, worry about, about it. Just it. let nature do its thing. And you guys are strong as F. Because we can't say the word. But, wow, <laughs> amazing. You know what? Okay. How about some silly stuff about the school? No, no, never mind. Let's just quit the question. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay. You guys, you guys have a lot of good friends and a lot of good people that love you and care about you. I know that all of us are going to be there for your... Premiere night, and I'm super excited. There's no premiere no night. night. <laughs> holy week. Yeah, it's Holy Week, Black Saturday, so. <laughs> there's no premiere night, but there's a lot of block screenings. It's okay. Okay, okay, how do I. Okay. But there's a lot of block screenings. There's I'm gonna like go to some of these. Block screenings being tell me, by tell me. Genie. Are they. Wait. No, let's have, no, let's have our own, like. No, we na- should do something, night. because, like, you know what? They're supporting. Yo. Yo, okay, Kirill, remind this stuff. Everyone that's watching. <laughs> <laughs> tweet me, tweet hey, me. Hey, tweet, tweet at me. I'm going to go to some of these because, you know what, I love these two, and I just want to, like, make everyone happy, you know. Thanks, We're going to do it. We're going to do it. I'm excited to see Girl's you. Made. No, no, you know what? I'm going to buy tickets, legit. I'm not even going to, mm-hmm, let's go. Do I have more questions? Number 13. Number 13, I know. Turn it away. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, mm, what's the first thing? Oh, this is actually a good question. What's the first thing you always look forward to when you're traveling? Like when you go to a certain place, what are like the first things that you need to do? Um, first thing I look forward to is the culture. Culture. Yeah. Just to. Because like, when you say culture, it's food, it's everything. Yeah. yeah. It's a new way of life. It's, it's nice. Well, what's the? Thing. the <coughs> what's your favorite place other than the Philippines that you've been to so far? Japan. 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 Okay, what well, what in Japan was your favorite thing? Everything. Dude, everything. Yeah. We need to go. I heard about, <laughs> about the robot cafe. You were yeah. Talking about. Yes. Yeah. Oh my gosh. But yeah. food. Um, the food's super nice. The place. Yeah. The, the shopping. The shopping. Just everything. The, the culture. In everything. General. Yeah. <coughs> I love that. I love Let's that. go. Yeah. We're going, right? Oh yeah. Well, we're going to the U.S. first. Shameless bug. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Oh, okay. it's time to promote? Oh, yep. I'll let them get to it. Yeah, um, so, <coughs> Never Not Love You, out in cinemas March 31. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Thank you um, for all the block screenings, guys. Yep, thank you so much, JD. It's directed by Finette Hedaunet by Viva Films. That was amazing. Hey. Bye, Thanks, hey, Brett. Thanks, Brett. Thanks for having me. I love you guys. <laughs> oh.